any mess or uniform. We have two front pockets here in our chest. Then we have two side pockets here. Then we obviously have our pants pockets, like a normal pair of pants, and two back pockets. So I utilize the two front pockets and the two side pockets. The first left chest pocket, here we go. And a few things here I'd carry. Now, a few, a few odd ones I'm gonna share with you, okay? So first is a pen. I would have a pen and a notepad to actually write down patient information. So that's our first piece. We'll place it to the side. Next, I would have an O2 wrench. So if we don't have an O2 wrench, we cannot change the spare auction. So I would always make sure no matter what, I don't care what's on the auction or what was new, I always have one on me, you never know. And I highly recommend this, by the way. Next was a pen light. So I could do a proper pupil exam, every patient, every time, pupil exam. Now here's the one that you might find interesting, okay? A needle <laughs> decompression needle I would carry in this pocket right here on my left chest, literally. Every shift, there'd be these four items in my left chest pocket. You never know when you come up on a call. Maybe you're in a trauma. <laughs> you got needle decompression. I have it in my pocket ready. I thought you'd find that one funny. Now, some interesting other things that were in my ch uh, chest pocket here. With the needle decompression, this is something very interesting that I've never shared before publicly. I would actually carry this piece of plastic right here. And I actually still have this piece of plastic right here. I never had the chance, thankfully I never needed to use this piece of plastic. Not the most sterile event, right? But just in case, I would carry this piece of plastic right here on my right chest pocket. And on the left would be right here, the needle decompression. So I was always ready for the events, right? One thing I don't have here is tape, but I would always have tape there as well.